Well, I had a meeting with our coach uh, a couple days prior, so he kind of gave me the news uh, in person there. So obviously excitement. Um, you know, it's an honor to be recognized in our league, and there's a lot of good players in our league and a lot of good players in the CIS. So, um, you know, it's a great honor, and hopefully uh, we'll have a good couple games against uh, the World Juniors. I think just the exposure that uh, comes with the game. Obviously, uh, the World Juniors has followed uh, pretty closely in Canada here, and uh, just to be competing against those guys and uh, a little exposure for Canada West and the CIS in general. Yeah, it'll be a little bit different, obviously. Um, I think three out of the other five guys I played with in Spain last year, so a little bit of familiarity in, in that sense, but uh, you know, it'll be good to be on their side for, for a change. Yeah, for sure, obviously. Um, for myself, I want to have a good showing, uh, whether it be you know scouts in the crowd or uh, you know just having a good game for for myself. So um, hopefully uh, to go out there and just finish off the the year on a good note would uh, be uh, be a good be a good prize. Yeah, with uh, this being my final year at Mount Royal here, um, gonna have to find a new place to play next year. So um, hopefully catch someone's eye or you know open up another opportunity for myself. So. Um, you know, this will only help. You know, it's in the back of my mind right now. Um, you know, we have a good good team this year. Uh, you know, we have the, the whole second half in playoffs we're to look forward to, so you know, I don't want to look too far ahead. Well, super excited for Tyler. Uh, it's, a, it's a great opportunity for him and, and puts him on a, on a really good stage with a bunch of really good players and lots of eyes and attention for him. And, you know, I, Tyler's been so good for us this year, and he's playing at such a high level, arguably the best forward in the league. And, of course, I'm biased. I see him every day. But you look at what he's done point-wise and how consistent he's been and just personally how great a guy he is and how much he's given to our program. You know, I, I really hope that this will help his exposure for finding a place to play after he's done his time with Mount Royal University. So just super excited for Tyler and his family. I think the biggest thing for Tyler, I mean, it, it, he's a humble guy, but it's just the recognition. Like he's being recognized as one of the, the best forwards in all CIS hockey and one of only six in Canada West hockey. So I think it's pride for him. And like I say, and he's earned that. And then for his family to communicate with his family and and to, you know, I don't know if it's going to be on TSN or not yet, but uh, just it's going to be such a fun stage and there's so much hype and hoopla around the Canadian junior team anyway. It's just going to be a really fun environment to meet some new people and have some new coaches and play at a very high level against a, a very good young hockey team. He's just, he's a, he's a really talented player. And in terms of consistency, in terms of the layers to his game, he's, he's just so valuable to us. And it's nice to see him get that recognition. I mean, he's, when I talk about the layers to his game, what I love about Tyler is, you know, he, he, he back checks, he forechecks, checks, he's gritty. He, there's a physical element to his game. He can skate, he separates from people with his skating ability. He makes plays, right? Like he's just not a one dimensional goal scorer. Like he has good eyes, he's got good feel. He, he knows how to make plays on the rush in the offensive zone. He's our best penalty killer, arguably. Uh, you know, and, and this year he's putting the puck in the back of the net a little bit f more frequently. So, you know, he's just a very elite forward that he's got the ability to play, I believe, at the AHL or higher. And I hope that as we go along here that we start to get those phone calls and he gets those opportunities because I've seen a lot of guys um, go to those levels and he's as good as any of them. I think it's really nice for Mount Royal University and I think again it validates what we're doing with our program and, and Tyler's a great ambassador for Mount Royal University and Cougar Hockey and, and I think just you know I know that he's excited to represent us but you know he's carrying the torch for our, for our school and these things and for our hockey program and as it goes with recruiting and as we talk to alumni and we're trying to re-engage everybody with Cougar Hockey it's, it's great to, be, uh, to have a representative on that stage uh, representing our program as well.